Silas Dean, January 4, 1738, OS December 24, 1737, Dash September 23, 1789, was an American merchant, politician, and diplomat. A supporter of American independence, Dean served as a delegate to the Continental Congress and then as the first foreign diplomat from the United States to France. Recalled to the United States, Dean was forced to defend his financial affairs in Paris, and the interception and publication of his letters by the British, suggesting that the American cause was hopeless, further diminished his reputation. After the war, Dean lived in Ghent and London, and during his attempt to return to America, he died under mysterious circumstances. Early Life and Family Silas Dean was born on January 4, 1738, O.S. December 24, 1737, in Groton, Connecticut, to blacksmith Silas Dean and his wife Hannah Barker. The younger Silas was able to obtain a full scholarship to Yale and graduated in 1758. In April 1759 he was hired to tutor a young Edward Bancroft in Hartford, Connecticut. In 1761 Dean was admitted to the bar and practiced law for a short time outside of Hartford before moving to Wethersfield, Connecticut and establishing a thriving business as a merchant. Dean married twice, both times to wealthy widows from Wethersfield. In 1763 he married Madable, not, Webb after assisting her with the settlement of her first husband's estate. They had one son, Jesse, born in 1764. Madable died in 1767. In 1770 Dean married Elizabeth, Saltant's tall, Evards granddaughter of Connecticut Governor Gerdon Saltonstall of the Massachusetts Saltonstall family. Elizabeth died in 1777 while Silas was in France. One of Dean's stepsons was Continental Army Brigadier General Samuel Blatchley Webb. Continental Congress, in 1768 Dean was elected to the Connecticut House of Representatives. In 1769 he was appointed to the Wethersfield Committee of Correspondence, and from 1774 to 1776 he served as a delegate from Connecticut to the Continental Congress. While a member of Congress, Dean used his influence to obtain a commission in the Continental Army for his stepson, Samuel B. Webb, who had accompanied him to Philadelphia. Dean excelled in the committee work of Congress, helping to coordinate the attack on Fort Ticonderoga and to establish the United States Navy. A dispute between Dean and fellow Connecticut delegate Roger Sherman about appointing Israel Putnam as a major general under Washington's command led the Connecticut legislature to replace Dean as a delegate to the Continental Congress. However, Instead of returning to Connecticut, Dean decided to remain in Philadelphia to assist Congress.